All right. <laughs> Welcome in, everyone. Appreciate you joining me. Um, I'm actually trying out something really weird. I got a uh, a suggestion from somebody that I could use a piece of software that's web-based where you can stream to two places in once. So we're actually live, apparently we're live on YouTube and we're live on Twitch at the same time. And I have both chat windows up. So yeah, I don't know how this is going to go. This might do my head in because I'm going to have to look at two different chats now. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if this is the way to go, but I thought I would give it a shot because I couldn't decide where to stream, right? So now I'm, I'm on both. <laughs> I feel like it'll be a once-off thing, to be honest. Um, so we're just going to give it a shot for an hour or so, maybe even, maybe even like 30 minutes, just to see how I feel with this. Um, it might not work. But yeah. Let's um, do some stuff. Uh, hello, 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 everyone. <laughs> Welcome in. Um, I'm wondering if the YouTube is actually working because I'm not getting any comments come through. So let me just talk to them and see if there are anyone's there. But yeah, thanks for joining me guys. I know it's uh, it's another stream that's probably at a very strange hour for you guys. Uh, it's verging on to 8 o'clock p.m. 8 p.m. here. Uh, but yeah, so I figured we would do some more Let's Draw Fantasy work. And I'm not sure if you guys saw my last stream, but we we took this. And we did this. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, I had to cut the stream a little bit short, so I didn't quite get to finish this guy. But I figured we could do we could do that right now. Let's draw. That's right. Welcome in, Andrew. <laughs> Long time no see, man. Hope you're doing well. Um, if anybody wants to do me a favor on Twitch, if you want to jump onto YouTube and actually see if I'm streaming, because <laughs> I'm not seeing any chat come up. It's really weird. I'm a bit unsure about this. It is working? Okay. Maybe everyone's just really quiet, or maybe the chat's not working for me. Let me see if I can refresh that chat, because I don't want to miss anything here. One second, guys. Let's put something on here you can watch. Yeah, it probably just didn't load properly, so I'm going to try and load it again. And if I can figure it out. <laughs> anyway, I hope you're all doing well. What's everyone been up to? Okay, I am live, so that's good. Where is the chat? I need the chat room. Oh, I almost saw it. <laughs> ah, okay. Just bear with me for a minute. Technical stuff going on here. We're gonna get this. Right, there is lots of YouTube comments. Oh my goodness, I'm so sorry guys. Um, we've got it happening now, so I'm gonna pop that chat out. Make sure that chat window stays there. And we should be good to go, hopefully. 
Okay, like I said, I'm streaming on both Twitch and YouTube simultaneously, and I don't know if it's going to work because I have two different chat windows up. I'm already very confused. Um, I think it's probably better to choose one or the other. I'm already deciding this and I haven't even started the stream. <laughs> um, Peter Digby, hey man, nice to see you in YouTube. Taylor, nice to see you too. Lots of peeps here. Chaotic Eclipse, I recognize your name from last time. Uh, poetry the best, I recognize your name. There's so many people here, this is awesome. All right. Well, since I've brought you all here, um, despite my uh, my worries about streaming in two places at once, we'll try and get some work done. I should at least give this a shot. Alright, so last time we didn't get this finished, um, but we're going to try and do it. Um, let's just get this guy finished and then we'll decide which place to stream at. I think that's probably the best thing to do uh, because, uh, yeah. <laughs> I think it's just streaming, in like if you want to actually have a conversation with people, I think streaming in two places is probably not going to work. Um, so, how many layers do I have available? This document does not have many layers. Uh, we have zero layers available. Well, that's that's great. <laughs> that's just what you want to hear, isn't it? Uh -uh, it's not what you want to hear. Um, what can I merge? I have to merge those. Oi, my dog! Stop it! My dog is licking her foot. My apologies. Right, moving along. We're going to change some line colors. And do you guys want to give me? Do you want me to give you a rundown of what, what I'm actually working on? Uh, have we got any new viewers here? Let me know. Uh, it's Jordan says in Twitch. Is there a reason you put a gradient on the other character characters in the sheet? Not quite sure what you mean by that. Do you mean um, the different colors going on? What are you doing, dog? <laughs> Go away. <clears throat> she wants her ball. Yeah. Come here. Up. There you go. Say hello. Take it. Bugger off. Um, yeah, clarify your question. I'm not quite sure I understand. We need to change some line colors, so that's what we're going to do somewhat quickly. Uh, Jordan says on Twitch, yeah, like I thought the colors looked different to your other finished products of those drawings. Um, I don't know. I'm just doing things. I feel how I normally do things. So yeah, I'm not sure, man. <laughs> Um, okay, so we do have some new people in here, so I'm going to try and explain while I work on this a little bit. Uh, last year I created a drawing prompt list, a fantasy drawing prompt list of 30 characters, and I decided to put all the characters into one image, uh, to just to make one big epic illustration. And I didn't get too far along. I got to about uh, prompt number 30, I think. Oh, 13, not 30. So, just recently I've decided to pick back up where I left off and continue. And so I was drawing each character individually in different canvases, but now that I'm coming back, I'm going to decide, I have decided to just tackle everything kind of at once, sort of, well, one by one, but in the same canvas, so that um, I can make sure all the characters kind of work 
together and it will be a bit more cohesive and so far it seems to be working I'm pretty happy with making that decision I might be able to speed this up if I use color fill to be honest let's see if we can do that I'm not 100% convinced on the color I've used actually. Yeah, I don't know. So many comments coming in. This is crazy. Uh, the quickly on Twitch says, I think he means when you drew the characters, they were all colored in differently, and now they're all in the same orange yellow gradient, right? Yeah, that's true. Um, it was looking too mishmash, basically, is the answer to that. Uh, I showed this on previous streams, but we can go and have a look again. So, this is a compilation of just plonking them in and because I did them all separately it just it wasn't working for me there's just too much color going everywhere and I don't know I haven't fully decided how it's gonna look in the end yet so everything you see in here is it's still just a placeholder while I um, it's just a placeholder while I work on everything else surrounding it. We can just dull it a bit so we can see what we're doing too. Um, yeah, so I'll come back to that once I've finished everything else and I'm gonna have to put in a, quite a bit of effort to kinda make it all work together. if you can even see what I'm doing here. It's probably not the most entertaining stream if I'm doing this for about 20 minutes. But um, these, these are important little bits. I believe it's worth doing. So I'll try and get it done quickly. Uh, don't forget if you... Um, I don't think I have super chats set up for both Twitch and stream at the same time. <laughs> this is awkward. See, this is why I shouldn't be doing a multi-stream. I just do not think it's a good idea now that I've started it. So my apologies to everybody who's jumped in. Uh, it's a learning process, you know. So we'll do a bit of work and then we will jump to one of the two platforms. I'm not quite sure which one. I don't know. Oh, somebody came from YouTube to Twitch. Well, there you go. That's cool. <laughs> Maybe I'll just get everybody from YouTube to jump on Twitch. It's not that hard, guys. It's, it's really simple. for following new new I don't know how to say people's names I'm gonna call you Ling thanks for following Ling I think my dog's doing something bad again 
Stop it. She's got problems. Licking her feet. Obsessively. I think I'm gonna have to take her to see the vet. Alright, let's um, forget the lines for a moment. I'm just gonna do something a little bit more interesting and then we'll we'll close off one of the streams and we'll restream. So what we do need is uh, I need to do a bit of maintenance here actually. do this, I should have done this before. Is that going to work? Yeah. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> I just needed the line up to be a clipping mask as well, so I can make another clipping mask on top of everything. And set it to multiply and we'll do some some shading well we'll try anyway we will try uh, oh, I need more layers this is tough guys this is tough I'm gonna have to just delete some stuff merge that down Make another layer first. Um, I just want to get in some of these highlights that I th think I will have. Thanks, Ling. Appreciate it, man. Uh, we have a question in YouTube that I'll try and answer. Uh, Thomas Anderson says, uh, what, is, what exactly is the goal of getting rid of the lines? Is this to make it easier to convert to that more brown style of the rest of the image. Uh, it's just something I do. It's just kind of more a stylistic choice, really. There's no particular reason for it. Uh, the lines are still there. They're just softer, basically. Um, so the way I kind of go about it is I leave the, the outlines of the characters or the solid shapes in black and I do change most of the inside uh, to, to a certain extent. It depends how depends how much time and effort I really want to put into it. Um, it's obviously easier just to not do it or to just do it minimally. Um, usually on like shiny things which is not really in here but or like metal or glass or things like that you, you change the line art color of that that sort of stuff. It just kind of looks cool. Um, yeah, so there's no like super duper reason why I'm doing it. It's just something I like to do. Uh, if anyone has a, a more intelligent reason on why we do this rather than it looks cool, I'd love to know. Anyway, so we're just add, gonna add some quick sort of glows in from the campfire. 
haven't decided, do I want to smudge it a little bit? I might do that. Just blend it in, maybe. He's not really that close to the campfire as much as the other characters, so that's probably pushing it a little bit. Yeah, I don't know about that one. Hmm. Anyway, now that I've done that, I'm just I'm actually I'm probably Just a little bit. And we'll get back to our shadows, which I didn't start yet. Anyway, I hope everyone's had a good day today. I had a somewhat productive day, which basically consisted of packaging uh, Patreon sketchbooks to send all over the place. Uh, it's actually really, really overdue, so I'm very happy that I finally got that done. But that took most of the day. <laughs> Uh, so this is why I wanted to stream just to make sure I do some drawing and or some coloring and, and work on this a little bit more Um, so with the multiply layer, I don't need to go in and make any selections or anything like that. Uh, just sort of universally goes over everything, and it's set to a clipping mask, so it's just gonna it's just gonna go on here. We're not gonna be able to paint in any of the white areas here, which is good because we don't want to do that. Uh, so I might just try to rough this in a little bit. been using the smudge tool a lot actually um, with the Sum Summoner Wars job that I've been doing I've just started using it a lot more to just quickly blend things together it's, yeah, it's not too bad although I am kind of going pretty quickly here It is really windy here today in Tasmania. Like, we're having crazy severe winds. It's kind of been freaking me out a bit, actually.
yeah, I would say this is definitely one of my favourite parts of colouring. Just getting in the shadows, making things pop. Pushing things backwards, bringing things forwards, you know. details here and there. Can't hurt too much. Uh, yeah, so uh, again, I apologise that I'm not responding to questions and comments and stuff at the moment, but like I said, it's just, it's too much. My brain can't do it. <laughs> Bad idea. Many regrets. It's okay. We're, we're going to switch soon and then we'll, um, I'll be able to focus on everybody properly. But I just want to get a bit more of this done first and then we'll, we'll switch. Yeah, Andrew Law, are you still using you still using Procreate, man? You were using Procreate before I was, actually. I remember watching you intently, and um, yeah, you were definitely one of the reasons why I picked up the iPad in the first place. So thank you. <laughs> big picture of what we're doing here. Uh, I do want some shadow coming that way, I think. This would be good. Actually smudging with uh, my new pencil brush, uh, tilt sketch. Which I can't. There we go. It's got a nice te texture. It's a very subtle, fine texture, but it is there, and I do quite enjoy that.
just ignoring the um, the thorn branches here for the moment. I'll come back and fix those up. Okay, well, we made a start. <laughs> I hope you got something out of that. Um, but yes, I'm gonna close down both streams now. I'm gonna head off, rethink this whole thing, um, grab a coffee and come back. And we're gonna jump on Twitch, I believe. So everybody on YouTube, if you wanna continue the stream, Continue to watch me finish this, this guy, and we're probably going to work on another character. Um, I do highly suggest that you jump over to Twitch. It is twitch.tv slash ableart. It's just another streaming platform, uh, mostly for games, but they have a whole creative section, and there's heaps of artists there who just are basically doing what I'm doing. Uh, so it's a great place to find other artists as well. Um, don't think I can put a link in the in the chat, but twitch.tv slash ableart. Uh, that's probably not a link, but you type that in, you'll get there. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching this very, very short stream. Uh, my apologies for the weirdness of it. Uh, I really just wanted to try this restream thing. And it totally works, which is cool. <laughs> but there's no way I can talk to both platforms at once. It's just too hard. So, uh, yeah. We will be back. We will be back live in, I would say, 10 minutes. 10, 15 minutes. So, I'll see you guys on Twitch. Thank you for joining me. And see you soon. Bye.